What's going on guys and welcome back to another video. So today we are in the Crazy Cart Repair Shop. So we have Melanie's custom Barbie Crazy Cart here and uh, it needs a new tire and I'm tired of, get it? I'm tired of putting tires and tubes in the Crazy Cart so we are going to upgrade it today, finally. So what we have in here is going to fix all of our problems. We have a taxi garage solid tire. So this thing is not gonna go flat and I'm never gonna have to have to put air in it before Melanie rides it or anything. So let's go ahead and teach you guys how to throw these things on there. So we got it on its side here. Um, basically we're gonna take these three Phillips screws out and then we're gonna take this top nut and then this one off and then we should be able to take it off and then just take the chain off and then we can get working on replacing the tire itself so I'm gonna go ahead and get started and then I'll walk you guys through the steps I took to get it all done All right, so I got it all taken apart here, as you can see. Basically, like I said, three Phillips screws. Um, this top one is kind of at an awkward angle, so just make sure you use a thick uh, number two Phillips, and you should be good, shouldn't strip it or anything. Um, and then, like I said, uh, take this off right here, and then the end right here. Um, they're both 17, so I put one on top and one on the bottom. And just crank them both loose and it'll come out pretty easily and then it has these sleeves one goes here and the other one goes on the bottom on basically the same area so you do that and then it just comes right out and then now what we have to do is we have to take these four bolts out and they are a they're a five millimeter hex so we're gonna go ahead and unscrew these and then we'll be able to take this apart throw it all on the new tire right there So once you get all four bolts off, you can literally just pull it off and start disassembling like that. It has that and then it has the sleeve and then the tire just comes right off. So now you just throw your new one on and just reverse everything. You're going to throw this on, you're going to put this sleeve in there, throw this back on, four bolts, put it on there, put your chain on. Um, tighten this long bolt, don't forget your sleeves, the Phillips screw, and you should be good to go.
All right, guys, so tips and tricks. So basically, this uh, top and bottom 17, do not tighten them all the way because you're gonna have to line these Phillips screws up. So my suggestion is don't tighten these up all the way. Find the top screw first and then do these bottom. Um, and once you get them all tightened down, then go ahead and tighten these two 17s and you should be good. Another thing I did was um, to line these sleeves up right here. I used a six inch quarter inch extension and I just fed it through the top all the way down. So nothing like the sleeve in the middle tends to move. So basically by doing that, you line everything up and then this bolt can just slide all the way up. And then you kind of have to squeeze the fork right here and it will basically just squeeze it and tighten it by hand and then it'll grab and then you can put your ratchets on and start cranking them down but that's basically it um, looks pretty nice with the taxi garage logo on the tire and like I said it's solid so I don't have to deal with these dang tires and tubes that always tend to rip so I'm glad that I get to throw all of this in the trash so yeah there she is this thing drives so smooth now. Look at that. So easy. So I'm happy with it. So there you guys have it. Um, if you guys have any questions about everything that I just did, um, make sure to drop it in the comments and I will reply to you. I may have forgotten a couple steps or some measurements for tools I use. So yeah, drop your questions down in the comments and I will get back to you. If you like this crazy car content, make sure you smash that like button and subscribe to the channel so you don't miss out on any other crazy car content coming up because we have a bunch. But yeah, thank you guys for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed. And as always, keep moving forward and stay on the gas.